Ah, so what if it's my night off, man? Of course, I'll tin bar while you take a break. This fancy's in the ladies' room, and she takes forever. Thanks a lot, man. I appreciate it. No problem. Have fun. <sighs> All the fancy's talk about marriage and commitment got me thinking about you. Noah, when you told me last night that I was the love of your life, I knew you meant it heart and soul. I was especially touched when you said that if for some reason our relationship were to end, that you would never love another woman the way you love me. Noah, you swore if we were ever apart and you met another woman, that no matter how beautiful or how nice she was, you could never feel for her what you feel for me. You vowed never to love another woman the way you love me. And I take comfort in your promise, knowing that I am and always will be the great love of your life. Yeah, you were my great love, but you're gone. Fancy, huh? Mm, here you are. I was wondering what happened to you. I ran into someone and we started talking. Ah, an old friend? No, I never met her before, but she seemed to know what I'm feeling. Mm, feeling about what? Relationship stuff. Ah, what's there to feel, huh? I love you, and we are happy, everything's fine, everything's perfect, perfect relationship. Are you okay? Did this woman say something to upset you? No, she just got me thinking. What's there to think about? Everything's fine, right? Look, I love you. I love you too. So, uh... So, I think I want to go to the hospital and check on Grampy. Okay. Um, do you mind if I don't come with you? No, I understand. All right. Well, call me when you're finished, all right? And we'll meet up. Uh-huh. Okay. Life is over and done with. Fancy, I thought you were going to see your... Maya. Noah, it's been a long time. Too long.